<laughs> to explain the motor effect, consider the magnetic field of a current carrying wire combined with that of a magnet. So, it's like this. So, this is the magnetic field due to the current in a wire. Then, this is the magnetic field formed by a magnet. Kung titingnan ninyo, ang direction ay from north to south. Laging ganon. And the result will be like this. So parang meron tayong dalawang magnetic field na nag interact sa isa't isa. At dahil sa interaction nila, magkakaroon ng force. At itong force na to ang reason kung bakit gagalaw ang wire. And this movement is what we call the motor effect. Consider the following pair of parallel current carrying wires. In this example, we have opposite direction for current. So this one is outward towards U, then the X represents inward or away from U. And the result will be like this. Combined magnetic field gives rise to forces being exerted on the wire. So anong mangyayari sa wire? Conductors carrying current in opposite direction will rip Repel each other. So, anong mangyayari? Yung dalawang conductors natin ay magmove away. So, tatandaan natin, pag opposite ang direction nila, they will repel each other. So, they will move away from each other. How about this one? So, we have the same direction of current. So, both of these are inward or into the plane or away from you. Okay? So, the result will be like this. So, the conductors carrying currents in the same direction will attract each other. So, they will move towards each other. Para maunawaan natin, let's answer this example. A strip of aluminum foil is hung over a wooden rod. A large current is momentarily passed through the aluminum foil in the direction x, y. So ganito natin siya titingnan. Pag dumali na yung kuryente dito sa direction na to, x, y, Ano kaya ang mangyayari sa ating aluminum foil? To discuss the answer, let us proceed to the next slide. The aluminum foil strip on the opposite side repel each other. So bakit kaya? Let's use this diagram. So kung titingnan natin, yung X side ng ating aluminum foil, yung magnetic field na na buo doon or na form ay it's moving counterclockwise. While for the Y side, it is moving clockwise. That's why with that, we have opposite direction of magnetic field. And again, if they are opposite, they will repel each other. So what will happen is that the aluminum foil will move away from each other. So, it will fold away from each other. These are the references used. And that's it. We are done discussing the motor effect. Watch the third part of this series on the lesson about electric motor. See you again in my next speech blog. Bye-bye! God bless! Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. <laughs>